Well, it's very tiring for me. Uh, we have to uh, fly in uh, Cotabato, travel uh, four hours to Jensen. Uh, I did a one-hour uh, briefing, and then uh, we were in the morgue for uh, five hours. And then uh, we ushered back uh, the cadaver to the viewing room. We terminated the conduct of the uh, autopsy, and uh, we exited the bow. So, uh, we will have the full uh, uh, forensics on that, on the specimens we collected. Sir, what's the... sir, sir before flying to, to Jensen, uh, you said that uh, you're still going there despite of the cadaver being already compromised, kind of impossible. But you said that uh, you were willing to take the risk, right? Now you just live in France. Uh, do you think that the trip was worth it? It was uh, more than worth it. We have very interesting leads. Uh, we have very interesting, uh, encouraging uh, results. I cannot, uh, as of yet, divulge the, the uh, results. These are uh, under laboratory uh, processes and examinations. Although the uh, the uh, crime scene, the human body of uh, Christine Dacera had been compromised. Uh, most of the pieces of uh, the organs are contaminated uh, due to the embalming, uh, but we have uh, very encouraging uh, results. This is part of the investigation. This is part of the process. We're giving them their uh, equal chance at the investigation level. If they ignore that, if they disregard the invitation, then whatever pieces of evidence we have at hand, by the time we have concluded the uh, investigation, then we will file the case if we see any violations. Sir, this a toxicology report. Uh, may hirapan ba tayo, sir? Lalo na, yun nga, nasabi nyo, yung evidence natin sa, yung pagpunta natin sa re autopsy, medyo mahirap na. Uh, tinitingnan namin dito kung uh, kaya pa, pero uh, medyo maganda naman ang sinabi na uh, kaya malalaman kung uh, presence of alcohol ito, level of alcohol maybe, presence of illegal drugs, level of uh, illegal drugs, doubtful. But yung presence, uh, kaya malaman, yung presence and level of alcohol kaya malaman. Sir, that uh, those individuals are not yet off the hook? Definitely. We, we're not uh, saying that uh, meron ditong makakasuhan. Uh, it's too presumptuous to say. It's too early to say. Ang sa amin dito, ano ba talaga totoo? If there were criminal violations uh, committed, who are the offenders, who are the perpetrators, who committed what, uh, anong uh, na-violate nila, how did they commit it, Anong support evidence namin? Uh, scientific evidence, forensic evidence, ibabangga namin doon sa ibang uh, pieces of evidence. Eyewitness account kung merong uh, testimonial evidence ito. Sir, yung 2207 po ipapasab nila, uh, sabi na rin yung po ba? Uh, lahat. Lahat. Sir, yung sa pagpunta nyo sa Jensen, ano yung pinaka-importante ninyong nakuhang information? Uh, yung pag-access uh, namin ng uh, human body. Uh, masasabi ko, the last time before she was buried, no? that was the last opportunity before she was buried yesterday, uh, tiningnan namin lahat against all odds. They said that uh, it has already deteriorated. There was rapid decay in some of the uh, pieces of evidence. There was contamination considering the embalming uh, procedures done on her. Uh, compromised uh, pieces of evidence. Uh, we acknowledge that, but despite all the odds, uh, may mga encouraging leads kami. Like, ilang percent, sir, doon sa investigation makakatulong yung nakuha nyo sa Jensen? 20% o malaki bang percent? Sa investigation? Opo. Uh, I would say around 80%. Wow. Makakatulong ito sa investigation. Oh, despite all the odds.
despite all the odds, uh, we're doing everything nakakayanin ng ating uh, forensic laboratories. Sir, uh, SOJ described the NPS uh, investigation as uh, not thorough. Sir, how will you describe uh, NBI's investigation? Well, uh, professional, we, we, we without the... Uh, 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 how do you say this? Uh, without commenting on uh, the other investigations, our investigation is going to be very legal, it's going to be very thorough. Uh, this is uh, forensic-based, this is uh, evidence-based, so we will have uh, scientific pieces of evidence. It will be backed up by uh, CCTV, digital pieces of evidence, electronic pieces of evidence. It will be backed up by, uh, uh, hopefully, uh, testimonial evidence. We have also some uh, psychological assessment going into the full range of uh, forensic capabilities. Sir, may nakita kayong suka doon sa crime scene before? Is it essential na or wala, meron pa ba mabibigat? It's still being uh, uh, processed sa laboratory. We, we are doing uh, test runs, we are doing uh, primary screenings, but uh, subject everything is subject to uh, confirma uh, confirmatory tests. Uh, I cannot, I cannot uh, say for now, but uh, I rest assured the public that uh, we are very encouraging leads. We are very uh, encouraging uh, pieces of evidence. Believe me, believe me. Uh, makikita dito kung uh, milapsis dun sa una. Anong lead po yun, attorney? Maaring may crime? Paano po? Anong lead? Sinasabi niyo? Meron. Maaring uh, may crime. That's what I'm saying. That's about 80% of that uh, piece of evidence that we have. Again, this is subject to uh, uh, confirmatory, but uh, I was just told, uh, medyo maganda ang uh, development. Maaring may crime? Maaring homicide? Ma may crime. May crime. Let's, uh, let's uh, uh, leave it that, uh, at that. Uh, may crime dito. Maaari ba sabihin na yung inyong findings maaaring supports doon sa uh, isinampa ng PNP na kasi? That's too premature. That's okay. too early to tell. So the, the, sinasabi niyo maaaring may crime because of the sorry, autopsy. Doon ang nag sa mga evidence sa crime scene. Uh, the, the, the human body itself is a crime scene. The rooms we inspected, uh, the three rooms we inspected we, where we conducted the uh, crime scene investigation, Rooms uh, 2209, 2207, and 2009 uh, at uh, the hotel in uh, Along Kalayaan Avenue. That these are crime scenes, but the human body itself is a crime scene. So in all of the crime scenes, yes, so, merong uh, magandang uh, leads. Okay, so combined attorney, combined lahat. Yes, yes, okay. combined ito. Uh, lahat ito efforts ito ng uh, buong bureau. The uh, Good director uh, Eric Nistor, uh, nakafocus siya dito. The uh, good secretary, Secretary Minari Guevara, nakafocus siya dito. Yung sinasabi niyong lead na at saka krimen po ito, mayroon po ba tinuturo na possible na ilan ang involved dito? Kung krimen po siya? Uh, we cannot say for now. We cannot say for now. But there are uh, good indications na merong krimen na nangyari. Pwede pong isa lang gumawa o maraming gumawa? Could be. Pwedeng isa, pwedeng uh, more than one. Sir, last na lang panawagan niyo sa mga hindi sumipot ngayon. Panawagan ninyo. We, we uh, respect your right, but uh, we would uh, appreciate it if you can uh, cooperate in uh, this investigation. If you want to clear your name, come with your lawyer. Uh, you will have the uh, full protection of the NBI. We will make sure that... Uh, uh, everything will be uh, uh, done according to our uh, rules, to laws. So legal yung uh, gagawing investigation. We will not take your statement if you come here without the assistance of counsel. This morning, uh, this afternoon, I understand the counsels appeared for the clients, but uh, we would rather that they appear uh, with their clients. We would appreciate that very much. Okay. Thank you. Uh, <clears throat> the question and answer for. When the agent can uh, ask the, the, the person, sir, uh, assisted by the counsel, 
for uh, other important matters, uh, bukan na nagsamparo ang NBI this morning ng kaso ulit sa ilang PhilHealth at uh, dating PhilHealth officials and the present PhilHealth officials. Sir, bukas na yun. Bukas, bukas na kasi meron din kami i-press noon bukas. Okay. Uh, meron meron kayong ano, bago po, bago tayo, bago tayo. Bago tayo. Uh, siguro 11, meron kaming uh, rescue operation sa Atrad. So maybe tomorrow uh, with the, our filing doon sa PhilHealth. Okay. Yes, Attorney, may sinasabi ang PNP, may solve, ang solve. Ah, paano yung i-classify yung sa inyo? Paano yun, sir? Yung may PNP kasi, solve daw, mayroong resolve. Pagka daw solve, parang mayroon silang mga elements na kinukonsider. Sa inyo naman po, paano nyo tinitingnan ang ano, solve ba ito? Resolve pa paano nyo? Anong classification? We, we will cross the bridge when we get there. It's too early to make statements when the investigation is ongoing. I would uh, defer to the investigation by our uh, debt investigation uh, division. And uh, we would rather make a clear statement when uh, uh, this is already concluded. Whether we conclude the investigation with the filing of the case, whether we conclude the investigation with uh, uh, closing the case. Sir, I get this point. Parang kung sa PNP case solve, sa inyo nasa kalahati ba tayo? Or pa-ending na ba tayo? Parang uh, more than 50%. More than 50%. Pero wala kayong classification kung ano? Wala kaming classification uh, as we speak. Wala pa. Okay. It's too early to tell. Okay. We do not really set a, a uh, time frame na like uh, two, three days. Uh, we would rather that we finish the investigation, a very thorough and legal investigation, uh, conducted by our uh, competent and uh, professional uh, agents and uh, the forensic experts.